Yesterday I got an email notification saying there was a new automaton available, so I put out a tweet on Twitter saying if it got 100 likes, I'd buy the new $100 automaton. And it hit it almost immediately. I'm an idiot, what can I say? And I'm a man of my word, so I bought the automaton, add it to the collection. Then this morning I get a Twitter DM from the fine people over at Hami saying, wait, don't, we already sent one to you. If I would have just waited 24 hours to post that stupid tweet. I told him it's all good, I was more than happy to have two, and I was looking forward to its arrival. And guess what showed up not even 30 minutes later? I've never done this before, but I've decided to do an unboxing for this Hatsune Miku Deluxe Automaton. The first thing I noticed is this is the first Automaton Deluxe that doesn't have a shadow box, like you can't see it through the clear plastic. I'm assuming it's because this one comes with accessories for the first time, which means that it's probably packed differently and not as great to show off. We have instructions, which is great because I have no idea how to use an Automaton. Interesting, they even have wig instructions for the first time. Very cool. The deluxes usually come with batteries, which is always nice. Very cool, we got a new Hatsune Miku automaton strap. Love it. And now for the main event. Oh, that's adorable. I don't know why it doesn't have clear packaging. That's adorable. Take the foam out of the mouth. Oh, look at that. There she is in all her glory. So this is really the first venture into official automaton accessories. A while ago, they had things you could 3D print yourself, but they've never actually sold accessories for an automaton like this. And it's very cool. The wig is held in place by a little elastic strap on the bottom of the automaton, so it holds in place nicely. And the wig is also removable, in which case you have a regular automaton, but with the cool Hatsune Miku color scheme. From a pure editing standpoint, this automaton's gonna to come in handy because it has two blue eyes, which means I don't have to rotoscope eyes out. I can just blue screen them out. Very cool. I believe this is also the first automaton to have a different color printed on its playable stem. The deluxes usually just have a black stem or the technos have this dot matrix on them, but I like the blue color scheme here. As per usual with these models, you have a 3.5 millimeter jack for an output. You have a low, medium, a high setting volume control here and an optional power supply over here. Power on. I have too much fun with these things. I know some people are gonna be upset that it doesn't sound like Hatsune Miku, but it, it's an automaton. What, what more can you want from this thing? There seems to be like a resonant frequency in the middle that causes a little more crackling. Interesting. I have to figure out how to play Yevon Polka or people won't forgive me. I actually like the deluxe model of this automaton much better than the regular Hatsune Miku. I think the hair works better as a 3D object rather than the 2D printed on the face. So having the ability to remove the hair prop and not have the 2D printed hair is a major bonus. So there it is, another automaton to add to my collection. I'm trying to reach a thousand because Guinness Book of World Records said they will not certify my record for most automatons unless I have at least a thousand. So if you want to help me get to that goal, consider supporting me over on patreon.com slash the real Selly G, you support all my automaton ventures and my unhealthy obsession with these things. And subscribe to this channel while you're at it. Maybe I'll continue to upload more assorted random automaton content to this channel that doesn't really fit on the main channel. But if you're looking for that like really nicely polished automaton content, be sure to subscribe to the real Selly G because that's where I upload most of my videos. And why the heck not? If you've made it this far into the video, go subscribe to my other other channel, Sully, where I upload non-automaton junk. <laughs> Nobody watches that. Thank you guys so much for all your support. Thank you to Hami for sending me this automaton. Not a sponsor, but please make a Sully G automaton. And as always, be kind to one another. Stay safe. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. <laughs>